Fertility hasn't always been the main driver on the property, but since my brother and myself took over the business from our father, it has been the number one focus because we realised that by having high fertility in the herd and getting cows and calf as quickly as possible, that has been the main driver of profitability in our business there. My name's Phil Tate and I run a dairy farm with my brother on the Illawarra region on the south coast of New South Wales, milking between 550 up to around about 580 cows and it's an all year round calving herd. Well, where we've come from with our reproductive performance, it was very low before. So we've had to make some really hard culling decisions and our 100 day in calf rate would have been below 30% and now we've been able to bring it up to 45%. So with the 80 day submission rate, which is now 84%, and at the moment there our calving interval is uh, 12 months and uh, 18 days. Another big driving um, report that is really important on the farm is the days in milk. And at the moment there it's sitting on 175 days, whereas previously we would have been out around 240 days. Getting cows in calf early and um, maintaining average days in milk down below 175 days is really, really critical. So that the more fresh cows you're milking, the more milk you're getting out of them and um, the more profitable your business becomes. Some of the actions that we've taken on this farm to improve the fertility is to have excellent data entry. We have a computer program, so I can look up any cow at any point in time and know exactly where they're going. Another area which has made a really big difference is having proper professional services coming in. So not only do they help with your herd fertility, they give you a report as well, which then outlines exactly the areas where you can improve. Another area which really makes a big difference is having good facilities. From the data entry to then having such a thing as like automatic drafting, which I think is absolutely critical. Another thing that has really helped with the fertility in the herd is the transition cow feeding. So what that means is when a cow is 21 days off having a calf, and then she's fed a specialised lead feed pellet. Another area which really makes a big difference is the staff training. And we've been able to utilise some of the Dairy Australia courses with the uh, transition cow management course, um, pastures for profit, and um, there was also a nutritional course as well. Some of the advice that I would give to farmers to improve their herd fertility would be to keep very good records, seek professional advice. That is extremely important to have very, very competent advice so you can in my, make an informed decision. Fertility is really important, but to improve it, it can be hard to know where to begin. We think a great place to start is by attending an in-charge fertility workshop or by working with a RepoRite advisor. To find one near you, Click the link in this video.